Pac Man never left. BDA. This is episode of One Piece. Senior Pink versus Frankie was a good episode, right? I enjoyed this episode. And it was mainly because we got some Senior Pink backstory. And the backstory, the soundtrack they had playing behind that was just great, right? You really enjoyed that. But at first, the beginning had Luffy versus Bellamy. And right now, Bellamy is beating the shit out of Luffy. Like, right now, Luffy is getting owned by Bellamy. And I don't think in a manga they had this many hits. Or Sean Bellamy get this, getting this many hits in. So, it, it was interesting to see Luffy doing that. Granted, we do know that Luffy is holding back because he doesn't want to kill Bellamy. So, you know, you can take that for what it's worth. Moving on, though, we see some Sherry and Leo stuff that I don't really care about. But it's funny because Leo is the only one that doesn't notice that Man Sherry cares about him in that way. That was a lot of irrelevant stuff. Senior Pink versus Frankie, where they're both men, okay? And they're both going at it as if they're fighting a manly battle. That's what we're calling it because Senior Pink is saying, listen, if you can take this hit, I'll let you hit me. So Senior Pink does the meow meow suplex, <laughs> you know, goes, swims through the tower, slams him down. And Frankie looks like he's down and out, right? But Frankie comes back, firing his eyes, and he goes iron punch. And he's basically Hajime no Ippo on Senior Pink. At that point, we go into the Senior Pink flashback, okay? And again, the soundtrack behind that was amazing. You know, it's reminiscent to, I guess, the Nami, um, episode of Nami flashback with Bella Mir. That's what it reminded me of because Senior Pink, we know the story of him, his wife, his kid, kid died, Gimlet, and you know, his wife, he never told his wife that he was a pirate, told her that he was a banker, goes away, kid dies. We know the story, but just seeing it animated, it was great. And Senior Pink back then, he, he was a smooth dude, man. His character design was epic. I mean, why, why wouldn't you like Senior Pink? He just represents what a man should be essentially so he really enjoyed that and that's basically the gist of the episode senior pink is one of my favorite characters one of my favorite executives uh from the doflamingo family all the other executives and most of them underwhelmed especially Trayball, diamante even pika they underwhelmed as, as far as our expectations of them but i think senior pink is one of the few that lived up to the hype uh, senior pink gradius um, Dillinger, I enjoyed. That's basically everything that happened. Next week we get some Kiros versus Diamante. Um, Kiros looks like he's down and out, but I think he's going to make a comeback there. So I'm looking forward to that. But this episode, good episode though. Um, I would say I would have rather seen more Frankie versus Senior Pink. I did enjoy the backstory. The Leo and Manchuri stuff, they could have shortened that. I mean, it was short, but it could have been shorter. I'm ready to see the Luffy versus Bellamy stuff, but we're not getting that yet. We keep getting glimps glimpses of it, but we'll get the full thing soon, right? We we're going to get that eventually. But yeah, that's it, though. Let me know what you thought about the episode. Do you think Senior Pink is the manliest man out there? But again, <laughs> let me know what you think. Like it if you did. Comment. Don't forget to subscribe. Have a good day, people.